Okay, phone's at 15. 15%. I think we can get a recording knocked out, so my back hurts. Because we replaced my old TV that was up here. You might have seen that in the last video. Last unboxing video. Um, shout out to my boy, boys, Nova. Um, the hell does he want to go by? Uh, Nick's Kicks 05, which you've seen him before. And I guess Lone Variable. I think that's what he wants to go by. That's what I'm calling him. Thanks, uh, a shout out to them for helping me with placing that thing. More specifically, Nick's Kicks for getting it outside down the hall. I mean, we obviously didn't have all this crap in front of it. This is stuff I gotta go through, but yeah. And that's the TV and brand I got the size. I fucking love it, dudes. But we got a new box today. We got one from uh, Poppeteer, I believe is what it was. And this is supposed to be a two box, two pop box. Um, let me look it up. Alright, so here it is the anime mystery box. So, it's two boxes, two pops per box. One signature, one common, one signature, one exclusive, two signatures, or two exclusives, which are going to be guaranteed $45 to $55 in total value. And all signatures are certified except for Naruto and Mies, although they have pictures to prove it. And these are the signatures. Which I hope I don't get Battle Deku because I'm seeing him in a couple months. Here's the exclusives and our commons. Really hoping I get something good. Like, just judging from this, the only thing I really want is either gonna be Majin Vegeta, Broly, Metallic Whis, or. Some of the more Dragon Balls, so I don't have like uh, maybe Chocolate Boo. Maybe that Goten too. I don't think I have Super Saiyan Goten yet. And then these are the commons that I could get. Let's see who I got. Okay, we got her all opened up. So, before we get into this, I want to say if you guys are enjoying the video, Sorry because of the fan, it's like a million degrees right now. Anyway, um, if you're enjoying the video, please, please, please hit like, smash that like button, um, destroy that fucking bell, and stop by on UB Cringe Lord, UB Cringe Lord's uh, channel because we are streaming periodically. We're gonna be playing through Borderlands, but ouch! Let's jump into it. All right, so we got. Ooh, <laughs> one I actually wanted. Come on, come on. I'm gonna start with the one that uh, I've already got. Different sticker too, which is, or not different sticker, but just no sticker on this guy. It's mint condition Jiren with the was that the Australian sticker? different sticker because he's usually supposed to have the uh, the toy convention exclusive sticker or whatever the purple one is that him and Toy Rookie have but yeah like I said I've already got this guy I got him in a chalice box actually you can see him up there next to my other chalice poles but this one is one that I wanted oh look at that That's the that's the sticker it's supposed to have. I don't know why Chocolate Boo has that, because I, I think he was a common, if I remember right, but... That is awesome. This is one that I actually really wanted, and uh, one that I obviously don't have. I mean, I'll take a Jiren any day, but I prefer to get something new. So you just realized that I forgot to check the values of these guys, so let's go ahead and... Jump in here. Oh. Let's see, cheering up in my top 10. Let's 
Since I've already got Jiren in my collection, I'm just gonna go through and see if I can find him here. Jiren, Jiren. Now let's hit. Jiren, Jiren. Where the hell's Jiren at? Oh, I passed it. Ah, there you are. Ah, 30 bucks, not bad. And then, let's see what Boo is at. Okay, regular Boo. Not bad, I kinda broke even. A little bit under, it's not as bad as the, uh, as the Big Apple box that should be going live. At the time of recording, it should be going live tomorrow. Uh, it's not as bad as the difference between the uh, Big Apple box. I did the math and I actually overpaid for a lot of those. I paid $75 to get them shipped in and I made $53 back. I paid $55 with like, six, I'm gonna say 60 bucks because I think it's how much shipping was. And I got one pop that I actually really wanted, one pop I can trade to somebody. We got some Dragon Ball collectors out here. And that was a oh, 53 if you add up the totals, uh, at least according to PPG. I still haven't checked the Funko app because there's differing prices, even though they use the same database now.